Hello everybody, this is your truly Mr. Steven and welcome to the Steven Factor. Happy New Year everybody, it is a new year in 2018 and also a storm. That's right, it's been official, it's a nor'easter once again and this is my fifth year I'm doing this nor'easter coverage. And I want to tell you, let's go outside right now because in case my phone will be messed up and everything. And I um, just want to let you know, do a little bit of point of view to see what snow really looks like. And here it is. The moment we've all been waiting for, Nor'easter, everybody, 2018. Now, let me just, whoa, look at this pile of snow right there. Um, I just watched the news this afternoon and it's been revealed that we have some uh, big weather conditions. And it's also a brizzle like, but take a look at this. Oh my goodness. You can see the big winds, the big storms, and my new camera, better quality. But look at this, it's like a pile of snow. And and to tell you the truth, this is not like a, a normal snowstorm, this is a blizzard storm. And you can see the cars are not actually packed yet. up actually because I don't like shoving these snow so much so <laughs> um anyways if you want to take a look around the corner you can see it looks monster as well uh, all the stores are open some of the stores are closed like Golden Cross actually holding this camera. Wow. Yeah. I love this stuff, you know. Um So people still going out, trying to carry this food and everything. And it's 24 degrees outside in Brooklyn. And the snowstorm will be stopping. how it goes, you know, I'm here to bless your family, um, like the announcement yesterday, that yeah, most schools will be closed right now, because yesterday, you know, um, it's got to be a major kind of storm, I mean, a major snowstorm, I'm sorry, and, uh, right now, it's been revealed that, um, when you watch the weather totals, um, the snow totals, supposed to be like about six, right now, Thank <laughs> you.
watch out too when you open the door. The door slams in the back. You know, the door this window. You can see the mother nature. How's she doing this? Look at that. Big, powerful winds. You gotta watch out. And take a look. You see the MTA buses is still running like, like, like it used to. Um, the big storms are running. Uh, all the MTA stores are still there uh, a little bit. Excuse me. And, um, just want to let you know uh, my fingers are cold. I need to warm up a little bit and everything. Uh, right now, I'm at my sense store. Trying to buy something for, <laughs> for my mom and everything. <laughs> so, um, just want to let you know, um, stay wherever you are, it's still to come, and I will give you more updates, and it will be perfect too. So, see you later. Peace. Alright, everybody, I'm officially back in my room, and as you know, you can hear my radiator is getting ready to pump it up and heat it up. I want to decide to share with you some of the, the bad, good news and bad news. Now, the good news is the storm's officially over. Um, the snow's already get, the snow's already fade away since the impact of the Northeaster. And just to let you know, folks, this is my fifth year I'm doing this Northeaster coverage on the Steam Factor. So I've done this Northeaster five years since 2014. When the open New York City school controversy where all began. Um, the bad news is right now is that uh, tomorrow will be cold. It's going down it's going to fifteen degrees and below four. That was almost like three digits. You have to bum it up. I want to show you the forecast. So here it is. Um, we have on Friday. Um, again, school will be open on Friday. So Friday will be 15 degrees below 4. We have Saturday, um, 12 degrees below 2. Sunday, 18 degrees before below 15. Monday, it will be rain mixed with snow, PM mix, 34 to 32. Um, Tuesday, 39 to 22. Wednesday, 30 to 21. And Thursday, 39 28 is from the weather from um, abc7ny.com on AccuWeather Forecast 7 Day. I want to give a shout out to my one for me, Rogers, Amy Freeze, Bill Evans, Jess Smith, and Lee Goldberg did such a very good job. Four meal allergists, one perfect team. And they did such a very good job, by the way. And just want to let you know, um, this year, hopefully, that Eyewitness News celebrating their 50th anniversary, which is on 2000, um, since 1968. So, I hope they want to do a special tribute to this outstanding organization. Now, um, the, the JFK and LaGuardia airports have delays as well, too. The snow tolls from Brooklyn's. And, and, and all the rest of the five boroughs have outstanding totals, even 11.5 in Flatlands. We have um, 9.0 in Central Park. That was the most important. I mean, uh, outstanding subtotals as well, too, and the biggest record in history. And hopefully this will be the first and the last blizzard and, and in this in this January winter area because this, this is the first blizzard. They have um, in 2018 history, so you know what I'm talking about. Um, anyways, um, I went outside. It's pretty cold. I took some pictures and everything. And even for the first time ever, I was on TV right in the middle of the Wheel of Fortune, um, you know, sharing the snow photos on ABC7.com. But the problem is that I completely missed it. Because my aunt and I have been shoveling the snow late, late this late um, since this evening, and then uh, one of my neighbors um, texted me and said, "I hey Steve, I saw you on TV right in the middle of the Real Fortune, and, and the time was there like 7:45, so I'm completely, completely missed it. So um, 
I really appreciate it. I won't try. I won't try to give a, a shout out to Tracy who saw that um, that um, that clip on the commercial because she saw me that picture and went quick. So I completely missed it, and that was when my mom was watching the middle of the novella. So that that's that's even completely incredible. So, anyways, thank you for, for that, Tracy. I very appreciate it. Uh, anyways, I'm going to wrap this thing up. But, anyways, tomorrow is going to be a, 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 it's going to be a frost day. It's going to be cold and bitter. Just bundle up, folks. That's the, the most important. Just bundle it up. And I will probably see you next time. And this is your street, um, Mr. Steven saying, do a by la familia. Thank you for watching the Steven Factor and a happy new year. And just want to let you know, I promise you, new episodes on the Steven Factor. And I will bring you some outstanding ideas. We're going to still talk about these political issues. And we definitely need that, these political issues, because right now the, the book is coming early. Inside the Trump's White House. So, this is going to be hell's breaking loose right now. But I'm not going to do that. But, uh, we'll see what happens. We're going to bring more guests from Facebook as well. Because I can't wait. We're going to bring more more guests back. We need, we need more guests on this like YouTube stars. Or get ready. So, I'm going to interview them. And that will be perfect. Like anime, politics, you, 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 whatever, whatever, whatever they want. So that's the most important. Okay, I gotta wrap this thing up and I'll see you next time. Take care.